Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the Business Network. I am Real Estate Rich Jackson. Welcome to the show. One thing I've learned about being in business, guys, is to really focus on helping people. Always be a good person, honest, um, and also look for, for solutions to solve the problems. Even when business slows down a little bit, if we just focus on those things, being a great person, trying to help as many people as we can, business will start flowing again, and uh, yeah, you'll start seeing the money come in. So it's all about that, and uh, being the best person we can be. All right, guys, it's around lunchtime right now, so it's time to go eat. I'm gonna go check out Sunnyside Diner and talk to Lupe. Great guy, great restaurant, and we're gonna go check out what he's about. Also, we're gonna head over to Central Flooring Supply today. We're gonna talk to Joseph. He's gonna let us know all the different types of flooring they offer, from laminate to vinyl flooring to carpet. All right, we've got a jam-packed show today. I'm excited, hope you are. Let's go eat. Hey, what's up, guys? We are here at Sunnyside Diner. I am super hungry right now. It's lunchtime, it's around noon. Um, we're gonna go check out uh, the diner, talk to Lupe, the owner. Um, he's gonna tell us uh, about his business. Got a couple questions for him, but most importantly, I'm ready to eat. They have some amazing food here, guys, and uh, we're gonna go check it out right now. Let's go. So here we are with Lupe, owner of the of Sunnyside Diner. I love coming to this place, guys. Uh, located on what? Beach, Beach, Beach. Beach. Great place. Uh, what I love about you guys is you guys have so many varieties of food in this place. So, one question I wanted to ask you How long have you been in business? I've been going about 12 years in January. Yeah. What do you think it was like contributed to your success? This uh, I think the community, you know, the community helped me, you know, survive through all this stuff that I've been doing with COVID and all the ups and downs of business. But it's just, uh, I got a lot of community support that supports the designer. And, Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, really yeah, 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 And I think they support it because the food is really good. <laughs> yeah, the service that, is that, that helps. The yeah, helps no, it really is. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's great service as well. Okay, okay, great, great. What great. hours do you guys stay open? Uh, we're from 7 to 2 Monday to Friday and 7 to 1 on Saturday. We're closed on Sunday. Gotcha, gotcha. One last quick question I got for you. What would you say is probably the hardest part about being in business, like this restaurant business? It's, it's, it's always up and down. Yeah. Yeah. It could be really slow and then business, but it, to me, I think just you have to go so far to start seeing the world start turning green. It's yeah. so hard, but uh, eventually we get a clientele, so they start supporting and the good reviews can always help. You know, saying Google, yeah, great reviews, Google yeah. will help. So that really does help. We get new customers, uh, get a lot of orders and stuff from all over the world. Oh, wow. Uh, support the Okay. You guys, make sure you guys come to Sunnyside Diner. It's, it's amazing food. You will not be disappointed. Oh, one very important. I love it. They got such a variety, guys. Like, you can get Mexican food. You can get Asian. You can get breakfast, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Breakfast and lunch all day. Every, all, Every day, day, all day, day, all day long. Like, it's, it's crazy. So right now, it's, uh, what time is it right now? Okay, it's 1221. It's 1221? Yes, sir. It's lunchtime, but I think I'm in the mood for breakfast. There you go. Yeah, definitely come, guys. Come by, support the local, but not even support. It's just really good in it anyway. So you'll love it. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Thanks a lot, Okay, thank you, Rich. Yeah, I'm going to definitely. All right, guys, here we are, Central Flooring Supply. We're gonna go talk to Joseph. He is a part owner, a young guy, but he's gonna show us about you know the business, uh, the different type of flooring they have, and uh, let's go check him out. So, what's up, guys? We're here with Joseph Nielsen, right? Central, Central Flooring Supply. Uh, man, they got every type of flooring you guys want, and uh, tell us a little bit about what you guys offer. Stuff like so, that. we offer anything from vinyl plank to carpet. We have in-stock flooring. Um, baseboards, anything you really need for flooring. And how long have you guys been in business? 29 years. Sir. 29 years? Oh my gosh. So, yeah, you guys got a pretty good clientele of, of people on it. Yeah. 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 We got a lot to offer, guys. So, if you're looking for flooring, um, apartments, houses, come see Joseph. He'll take great care of you, I'm sure. So, is it like um, if someone is interested, do you recommend they come into the shop here and then kind of see what you got, or should they start online? 
Uh, we have a really good website with everything. There's a software on there where you can show, where you can take a picture of your house and it will show you how it would look in your house. Really? On but the coming, coming into the store is always better. Okay. Do you guys have like a flipper special package? Like a lot of flippers get a certain type of... So yeah, we do work with a lot of contractors, flippers. They usually get like the contractor pricing almost because they're bringing in jobs all the time. Because yeah. typically if a general, someone redoing their house, they're a customer one time for every like five years. Right. Because right, they're right. doing they're only doing their house. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Well, you gotta repeat business, then you can work with them. Yeah, so installers, contractors, anything like that. Now how long have you been working at the end of business and how are you doing it? So I started in high school, I would come in just work in the warehouse. Um, 18 about I started installing with the guys, with the whole crew. And then from there I jumped out of installing and worked in the warehouse. Just unloading trucks, loading trucks, keeping inventory, stuff like that. And then from there, kind of jumped into sales. While I was in the warehouse, I'd just take pictures of stuff, post on Facebook, try to get sales on the side. Yeah. And then that kind of transitioned into measuring jobs for these guys. And from that, kind of making my own sales. Right? And you're young, bro. You're like, what, what are you, 20, 21? 21, yeah. guys. So and you, you've been around this industry your whole life. You know, you grew up with your parents, your grandparents are in it. And that's a blessing, so I'm sure you... You know. Guys, come check them out here. Uh, we are, this location is where? On 5963 East Clinton Avenue, just off of Clinton Valley. East Valley. Awesome, sir. Thanks so much, Joseph. Appreciate no you, my man. <laughs>